you probably haven't heard before. But with its driving beat and soulful lyrics, it sounds familiar. With a chorus line you could end up singing along to in no time. And that's exactly what this Nanaimo-based band wants you to do. For Steve Palin and Dan Dubay, the frontrunners of Herbicidal Maniacs, their West Coast folk rock inspired band is built on giving their audiences the experience of live original music. I think we have a really good sound. We have country kind of tunes, we have rock tunes, we have blues tunes, it's, and folk tunes, it's all there. Yeah, we want them to have a good time, we want them to enjoy the music, and we want them to come back. There's something to be said about well, listening to your stereo or, or listening to music at home as opposed to watching a performance and it's it's just there's an energy there that just needs to be experienced. And that energy stems from Steve's heartfelt life-inspired songwriting and the band's ability to take risks. From an 80-year-old teacup reader to the never-ending muse of love, Steve writes about it and then the band shapes the songs around his words get an idea and we'll just keep working on it until it sounds good, you know, until we're all happy with it, you know. It is a band effort and it's a joint effort and everybody has a say. Influenced by the likes of Cat Stevens, Bob Dylan and Van Morrison, the band's music reflects on the spirit from the 60s and 70s which is often associated with the era of free love and lots of herbs. Given their name and their branding, you'd think they indulge, but they don't. The music is all the inspiration they need. To be able to, I guess it's just be able to express yourself as opposed to having somebody um, that you're just trying to emulate or replicate. It's a, it's a, it's a different experience. Many times, I've been in the zone, we're playing, and that is the best. It's the best. You know, you're playing, you know, you're looking at each other, and you, you know uh, it doesn't get any better, you know? These are the great times, and when we're old and defunct old, we'll, we'll remember that. Steve, Ed, Brent, and Dan are inspired that the music that they've listened to and loved is in turn inspiring their audiences of today. The guys are in the process of recording their second album and are looking forward to bringing their West Coast folk rock sound to more venues across Vancouver Island. In Nanaimo, I'm Jocelyn Natwee.